remember the age that you fell in love with the game? How old were you? And um, yeah, take us back to the very start, mate. I'd probably go back uh, at least 10, 12 years. I would have been in pre-primary or, yes, about five or six. And dad brought me down to Auskick and, yeah, it all just started from there. And my footy just, yeah, kind of just kept on developing from there and got me to where, where I am now. Fantastic. So you, your dad, did he play footy as well? No, so my dad's actually not from Australia. He's He was born in England and he grew up in England and he moved to Australia when he was about 20, early 20s. And ever since then, I think he's just really been into footy. And yeah, he's obviously, it being one of um, Australia's biggest sports, he's, yeah, he just kind of a, a, adopted it and yeah, he really loves it. And uh, what about 2020, mate? Obviously, it was, it was a pretty challenging year for, for many. Uh, how was it for you? Did you have a good year? Was it a challenging year with footy? Take us through what 2020 was like um, for you. Yeah, just like over in Perth, we were like quite fortunate that the just in terms of like coronavirus, everything was quite good over here compared to the eastern states. So, like we did only get about a 10, 10 round um, season in, but obviously it's like yeah, like you you, you guys over east is yeah, it's obviously better than what you guys had and. I think I did have an all right season, like in terms of circumstances. And yeah, I'd, I'd say we're fairly lucky over here. And when you're playing your best footy, um, like the game against Peel Thunder, how would you explain your style? You know, how do you play the game? Um, I'd say, yeah, so most of my goals in that would have been just isolated. The ball comes in and I'm one on one and I'm using my body to either work my opponent under the ball or just, yeah, having a run and jump at the ball. I'd say my marking is probably like my, an upside to me kicking most of my goals in the forward line. What about going into this off-season, pre-season? What's uh, a focus been? Uh, do you have a particular a goal in mind um, or is it more, do you have more a generalised approach to your off-season, pre-season? Um, well, no. So going into the pre-season, it was always just to kind of develop to play with the bigger bodies in the senior team at Claremont. So, yeah, p- playing against fully grown men rather than kids my own age. So, yeah, it was obviously, yeah, I was obviously just pushing myself to be in contention for playing um, senior footy round one. So, I would say that's probably my main focus this offseason. Cool. And, that, and you mentioned that you do some extra work. You head into the club early and, and do your gym work. Um, what what's, uh, what's like a routine yeah, yeah. do you do? lower body on Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, or is it upper body, or do you do whole body? Yeah. What does that look like? Since I do befraying, I generally like to keep them upper body so my legs are still fresh and ready to run during training. And then the days, so I'll go once during the week, either on Tuesday or Thursday, through legs, and on a Saturday or Sunday, I'll, I'll also do a leg session. 